Today, I'm going to show you guys everything we picked up from the Mint Collective out in Vegas. That includes 200 graded cards and a whole lot more. So many people to thank and know that, like, like you said, this is, this is only the beginning. Welcome back to Card Talk. Thousands of people. Collections, card shops, and collectors. 47.5. You're, you're good to go. All right, man. <laughs> a lot of time ahead and a lot of opportunity to, to, to make this place special every day. So. All right, what's going on, YouTube? Card Collector 2 coming at you here with a brand new video. And today, I'm back to show you guys everything we picked up from the Mint Collective out in Vegas. Uh, if you guys have not seen the first two vlogs, they are down below uh, from both Saturday and Sunday out in Vegas. Where we were able to pick up quite a bit of different things. Uh, and like I mentioned in the intro, 200 graded cards. Uh, so a lot of those to get through. So we're just going to jump right into it. Have a lot of stuff to show. Uh, and as I mentioned in the vlog, there's 200 of these. Uh, some of them I feel like are really cool cards. There's like a KD10 rookie, a uh, lot of variety for sure. Uh, but then there's going to be some things in here you're going to be like, that's a little, uh, a little off on price. But ended up going back and giving a, a few more dollars on this deal. Uh, it had a lot of, a lot of variety, a lot of cool stuff, and I just felt like the original price was, uh, was just not enough. So want to show you guys what was in that deal, and then of course everything else. So. Normally, there's not this many cards in here, but I have three rows of piles, and I even have a couple right here. So let me show you guys what was in it. Uh, Jalen Suggs, uh, Towns, Frank Mason, uh, Nova, Patch Auto at a uh, PSA 10, uh, Tony Oliva, Oliva, PSA 8, Heritage Real One Auto. It's kind of cool. I like this one. It's got Joey Votto on it and Perez, uh, both reds. <clears throat> not sure. Star Trek Autos. Uh, some Panini Instant UFC Pop 2, uh, Anna, Barbara Williams Auto, like this one, Tremont Waters out of 49, 25, I'm not sure that's going to be there, uh, Lillard 9, again, I think some of the greatest stuff, uh, the, the prices listed were high, but obviously got them for a significant amount less, uh, D. Rose, Robert O'Reilly 9, uh, definitely one of the ones I felt was a little, little strong. That was a Ben Simmons Excalibur rookie. Uh, just don't see it getting quite to the $48 mark. And then a really cool one, Global Pulse, Global Poster for Star Wars. Uh, this is from Poland. I thought that was cool. It's in, uh, it's a PSA 10. It's got to be, yeah, Pop 5. Um, I don't know when this poster would have come out. Star Wars Return of the Jedi. Wow. Old school. So, pretty cool. Thought that was neat. There's definitely some Star Wars stuff in here, and obviously uh, we talk about it, but love having that variety, especially in shopping on our whatnot channel. So, for us, it was cool to get some of that stuff. One of the easiest selling things on whatnot or in shop for us is cheap Jordan LeBron slabs. They sell like crazy, uh, so those will fit in perfectly there. Uh, like this one, Gary Trent Optic Hollow. Uh, PSA 7 at $40. I have a feeling uh, that's that's not going to be quite there. Same thing with uh, Hazonja. PSA 8 auto. More MJ. Drexler. Uh, again, just pop one. PSA 9. This card's probably 10 bucks, 8 bucks, uh, Maybe 12 or 15 if we really get up there. But PSA 9 doesn't do much for it. Luca. Uh, Dirk. Don't know who this is, but TJ Clark. PSA 10 from uh, Topps Chrome Overtime Elite. Uh, some UFC stuff I don't know as much about. Uh, Chase Hooper. Uh, Sterling, like Octagon side, I think is what that's called. Uh, Killian Dane, Kevin Holland, Holly Holm, Kobe, Silver, PSA. Like, I have a feeling that's probably higher than 20 bucks. That's definitely not that high. McCollum, 9. Uh, Justin Allgaier, Dal uh, Samuel Dallenberg, Auto from Stadium Club. Uh, PSA, 8. All right, I'm just going to try to put these in there because there's so much stuff I want to try to clear up some of this desk space. Got a couple of the one rows next to me to put some of this stuff in there. All right, another pile here. Uh, Thaddeus Young, PSA 9, Patch Auto. Love a good tie-dye Patch Auto from Select. Probably one of my favorite products. Uh, Mo Harkless, 9, Derek Arnold. This is cool. Again, like the Star Wars Chrome Galaxy has probably some of the best photography uh, in all of cards, like... Just an incredible looking card. Same thing with like Stadium Club Chrome. I think that's one of the cooler like uh, photographs on cards. 
that they make. So shout out to Tops on that because I think those are super cool. Uh, PSA 9 auto, Curry, KG PSA 6, uh, Simons 9. These are cool. These are, what, 30 year Kobe Tops? Uh, there's a 9, Simons 9, Chandler, another cool Star Wars card, 20 bucks. Like, seems like a no brainer on those. Uh, General Leia Organa, 9. Uh, Ultra Tech, I have no idea. Law Knight, LA Knight, I'm not sure. Uh, how that's pronounced not a WWE guy and then a Pokemon PSA 9 nice and shiny and cheap so should uh should move here is this so this is obviously separate but this is my favorite pickup from the entire weekend I uh, paid really 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 strong on this but I really wanted it uh, George Russell Dynasty from 2022 uh, just an incredible patch piece nice bold auto BGS 10 uh, yeah just hard to complain about something like this so one of one that will uh, that will definitely stay in the PC. Uh, hadn't picked up a little F1 in a while, and I feel like the last like couple weeks or so, I've been able to uh, acquire a couple cool things with that, like the Lewis Duel, uh, the Christian Horner First Year Dynasty, just a couple couple cool things. Uh, some Star Wars Khabib Nine, uh, Alec Thomas. I know who that is. Uh, PSA Ten doesn't seem too bad. Uh, Aaron Fletcher. Some of these guys I don't know much about. More uh, baseball guys. Hernandez, uh, Izzy Wilson, 10. Torque, 10. Uh, Sean Burke, Bo Bichette, 9. Chris Paddock, uh, Vlad, Chrome, 10. Base, just tops Chrome Black, not a rookie or anything. Adele, Finest, I don't think he sells like he used to. That seems a little aggressive. Uh, Abrams, 9. Khabib, out of 99. Uh, Kyle McCann, Luis Garcia, 9. Greg Jones, 9. And then a Wander uh, Sapphire Edition PSA 9. Alright, so finally have some breathing room here with all of these slabs. Still a ton more. Alright, let me get some of these out of the way here. Uh, Isaiah Todd, Jersey Auto, PSA 10. I have no idea who Isaiah Todd is. Uh, Alex Caruso, 10. Again, cheap, cheap LBJ. Uh, Simons, Trey Mann. I feel like that could be good. I feel like he sells okay. Uh, Carter Keyboom, Kaiboom, uh, Barnes, that's cool. Uh, Lynette Woodard, not super familiar, but PSA 10. Uh, McCollum, Damian Lillard, Rudy Gobert, Kevin Knox, 6 for 30 bucks. That seems seems a tad aggressive. Uh, can't sell that dude. He doesn't, doesn't sell, for us at least. Uh, Beverly, Jemias Ramsey, PSA 10, and Casey Akpala, BGS 9. So, again, a couple things in there I think are probably a little little steep all right one more pile here cool card but it's a seven uh, mount castle out of 53 corbin burns uh perez no price on this one but roberto ramez uh, robert paulson 10 isn't he supposed to be big like prospect for the a's I feel like i know that name but I feel like i haven't heard much from him uh psa 8 auto nine uh john gray max schrock uh, this is a cool card it's just RJ Hampton, a uh, little lumberjack from Goodwin Champions, hand numbered five of eight, uh, Matisse Thibel and TJ Washington. So, again, as you guys can see, there's there's some there's some cool things mixed in, but to me, it was a lot of the uh, a lot of stuff I expect to sell somewhere in the five to ten dollar range. Obviously, some some higher stuff, and there's some cooler stuff in in the deal, um, but a lot of uh, a lot of cheap stuff. This was. Part of that deal, but some of the uh, prices marked value boxes showcase type stuff. I got a Garrett Wilson auto at 25, uh, Truex Jr., Mike Williams plate, Traylon Burks auto, bunch of FOTL parallels. Here's a couple uh, Eddie George and Watt out of 11. Hendrickson, I talked about that in the vlog. Uh, he doesn't have a ton of stuff, uh, so I feel like that could be okay. And then a game used KG for five bucks. Akil Harry is just too cool to pass up. If I'm not mistaken, didn't Akil Harry end up in Chicago? Like, is he going to do anything for Fields, or is or his playing days done? I don't know. It would be cool if he could play with Fields, because I think Fields could be okay. But the patch was really the reason I bought it. A couple golds. Henry Ellard, Otto, and Tolbert, base rookie. Uh, 5 of 10 and 7 of 10. Uh, OBJ, the catch. It's number 18 of 25. Montgomery, who I believe is a lion now. And then a couple of Joey B's. Again, prices were pretty aggressive on these, but 
Joe Burrow's pretty, pretty liquid for us. He definitely moves. Uh, some more stuff. Uh, McGregor 10. I thought that was cool out of 25. Uh, AJ Dillon, that's the red zone. That's the contenders. FOTL. Uh, Lillard. Uh, Kaboom, 9. Uh, Messi, 10. Numbered out of 225. And here's another deal. I uh, have the Trey Man out of 8. Some of these galas out of 8 do well. They're hard to find. Um, and I know over the years some of these have done really, really well. So pick that up. Kenneth Walker. Patch auto at 99 for one sixth, one fifth, uh, one fifth or one sixth, whatever. Somewhere in there, uh, the price of a box. I feel like that was pretty good for a top six, seven, eight rookie. Uh, Hutchinson, Hyper at a 175, and then a, just an Acuna uh, BGS 95 gem. Baseball starting. Figured I'd grab that. Didn't realize this was what it was when I bought it, but um, he had kind of mentioned it to me that these are pretty rare. And I, that is definitely the case. Tayshawn Prince, this is like the rookie premiere auto <clears throat> from back in the day. And I was uh, I was pretty su pretty surprised to see how well this card sells. Um, it's, it's a really cool looking card. Um, but Kentucky guy um, and Tayshawn was on a uh, title team in Detroit. So I thought that was neat. Uh, NT LeBron. I have uh, a few NT and Immaculate base. I kind of like the LeBron high-end base cards um, because he doesn't have autos from Panini. He hasn't had up, upper deck like basketball autos in what 10 years now. Um, so I kind of like some of the high end base. So I got that. I intend to keep that. Joey B. Kaboom. Uh, PSA 10 horizontal. Uh, Fields gold out of 10 from select artistic selections. It was crazy because when I was looking I saw like a non-numbered artistic selections do like a thousand bucks. So it's kind of surprised to see a gold did like 8, 10. Um, but I think Fields will be hot going into the season. Some value box stuff. Again, just was digging through a value box to, to buy some random stuff. Could not believe these sell as well as they do. Uh, Kittle, Lafreniere, uh, some WWE. Uh, talked about this on the uh, in the vlog if you haven't seen it. But it has George Bush and Mickey Mantle. Uh, Sorkin jersey, Trevor Keels, Ellie, some WWE. Uh, J-Rod, Matthews, and Chris Olave. So... Again, not a very expensive, but for 35 bucks, felt good about that. Some more, uh, some more slabs. Keegan Aiken, uh, Mejia, Lou Gehrig, kind of cool. Nova, Mountcastle again. Uh, Luis Garcia, it says, huh, I just noticed that. It says pop two here and pop three here. It's interesting. Uh, Devin Williams, uh, Concy, no, no, don't know. Chris Murphy, Adley Rushman, nine. Didn't he start... I think he started the season five for five and a home run in that game against Boston. So that might be decent. I know it's prison draft, but if you're hot, you're hot. Luis uh, Arias, uh, AJ Alexi, Luis Robert, Chris Bryant, Brendan Malone, uh, Medina, uh, and Randy Johnson. Like, that's cool. Pop two black and white mini diamond refractor. I feel like that'll sell for more than 15 bucks. Just a cool looking card. All right, got to run out of desk space on this one. We'll do one more pile of graded, and then we'll move on to some of the other stuff. Uh, Diaz, Murphy, Cole Hamels. I like the Topps Chrome Platinum Anniversary. I'm not much of a baseball guy. It's not my forte, uh, but it's kind of cool that, uh, I mean, I feel like those are those are good-looking cards. Madrigal Auto. Wasn't he another one of those guys that was a big name at one point? Like, I feel like remember, remember hearing, I remember hearing a lot about this guy, and I don't think I hear much about him these days, but... If you're a baseball guy, want to provide some insight on Nick Madrigal, would love to know. Uh, Sutter, Kyle Lewis, 20 bucks Again, at one point, Kyle Lewis was crazy. Uh, Luis Garcia, Bowman Chrome. Those patch autos are hard to hit. I don't know much about Luis Garcia, but nice orange refractor patch auto. Uh, Justin Dunn, uh, Candelario. This is cool. Bobby Dorr. Oh, I didn't realize it was auto. That's kind of cool. Cut Signatures Navy Blue. That's neat. That's actually really cool. From Leaf Lumber, looks like, yeah, Leaf Lumber Marks, 5 of 7. That's cool. Uh, Mookie, Fernandez, uh, Robert Moore 101, another Robert Moore with an inscription. Uh, Wander 9, that's, I think those, I think that's what 10s do. Uh, Steel City Slammers, Will Robertson, Tom Henry, uh, Kyle Lewis again. 
Duran, Cabrian Hayes, Vlad, and then Wander Nines. So, again, kind of slowing down on the excitement. There's a couple piles left that I know have some of the uh, cooler cards. Here's this deal. Again, I talked about this in the vlog. If you guys have not seen them, they are both down below, both days one and two. Uh, but this deal, I think it was $120. It was... Yeah, it was like 100 for these and 20 for these. So it's Chad Henney, Patch Auto, again, Michigan guy, uh, but did suffer one of the worst college football losses of all time uh, when Chad Henney, Mike Hart, Jake Long, Mario Manningham uh, lost at home uh, to Appalachian State. Good snap, good hold, and the kick is blocked! Appalachian State has stunned the college football world. One of the greatest upsets in sports history. Uh, still one of my all-time favorite college football memories uh, is watching App State nearly return that kick uh, at the very end of the game to defeat Michigan. Incredible. Incredible. Uh, Chad Henney. Uh, Mike Rozier, Auto, I talked about that. I think that could be a, a pretty solid card. Jeff Janis. Kurt Angle, it's like a, like a patch auto. It says SummerSlam. Looks to be manufactured. Yeah, commemorative logo patch, but it's cool. It's numbered to 10. I feel like that could be okay. Moose Johnson, exquisite game used uh, patch out of 75. Dallas Sells. And then a Charlie Joyner jersey number auto from Gold Standard. Uh, Sean Andrews, sign of the Times auto. And a Darbo patch auto out of 25 from Flawless. Not my favorite. Again, yeah, talked about this in the vlog. I looking at comps of this they're all over the place like there's a uh, out of there's like a bunch of different versions of this there's like a red an orange green a um, few different ones um, and the comps literally are all over the place uh, 500 bucks I'm like that seems like a lot for Jordan Love but you look at some of the sales and you're like yeah it's hard to argue like so he had 535. I was like, what do you want? He's like, I'll do 500 bucks. Yeah, and I was like, I'll take a chance. I think this, I think at some point they move Rodgers. They haven't yet, but I think at some point they move Rodgers and somebody will be interested in it. He could sell it to National. Uh, I'm not sure, but it, it felt like a safe buy at $500, which sounds crazy. Uh, this was a card I got for attending the summit. Comes with like the, the, the package I bought for like the ticket. Um, was, this is the card that came with it. So it looks like a custom card of Kayvon Thibodeau, defensive end. It's kind of cool. It's encased. Don't know how many of them they made, but got, got that. Uh, Olave, Paris Campbell, 101. Incredible gift. That is so cool. Uh, excited for that. Ryan Howard, uh, 101. Uh, Joe Burrow, Joe Burrow Laser, Aiden Hutchinson, uh, with that awful inscription. Uh, T. Higgins, and then a Joe Burrow Reactive Gold. All right, another pile. Couple Got a couple of these, uh, 60 bucks. Uh, they got put in the wrong bags. I'm like, that's crazy. Uh, I think when the, the editing guys were taking photos, they put them back in the wrong bags. They were the opposite pricing. Uh, but Ron Perlman, Sons of Anarchy, Auto, um, and then Kobayashi. I was like, for 20 bucks, like that's kind of cool. Somebody will want that. Um, and then Sons of Anarchy Auto. So, got those for 60 If you watched the vlogs, you saw this. Uh, if not, here's a little something they did back in the day. You could pull these in packs. This is like 08 Letterman. Yeah, 08. Uh, I thought back in the day they had one of like Chris Johnson and uh, Matt Ryan. So, I wanted them for my name. Uh, but I never ended up getting them. But this is a really cool set they did back in the day. So, Steven Jackson full nameplate like on a card. I mean, you guys can kind of see it here. It's, it's kind of crazy. Um, but it's numbered. Let's look on the inside of this. Yeah, 26 of 46. Thought that was kind of neat. It'd be a cool one to frame, right? I mean, people are always buying Letterman. It's autographed. Thought it was cool. So I picked that up. And then some more stuff in that deal, some value box stuff like Logan uh, Logan Wilson for the Bengals. I don't know much about her, but I thought this was neat. Uh, so you read the back. Uh, Michelle Akers, this is Topps Chrome, uh, Allen and Ginner. Uh, yeah, Allen and Ginner Topps Chrome. And it's numbered to 25. 
It says Akers was named FIFA's Women's Soccer Player of the 20th Century after a 15-year international career that produced 105 goals in 153 matches. She joined Team USA on its inception in 85 and scored the first goal in team history uh, and, uh, and used her skill and strength to propel America to two World Cup championships in 91. She claimed the Golden Boot as the top scorer in the, of the first Women's World Cup. So, a lot of history with Michelle Akers that I... I was obviously not aware of, but I thought that was kind of cool. And it was like three or five bucks out of 25. I'm like, Women's World Cup, I think, is coming up. Is it? Is it this summer? Um, I feel like it's relatively soon, but I, I grabbed that for a few dollars. Uh, Posada out of 50. Yankees and Red Sox, they sell. Uh, picked up some Trump cards. Um, not a political person. I, I don't do politics. Um, too divisive for me. Not really my cup of tea, but uh, we get asked for them, so... Pick them up. If it sells, we'll, uh, we'll have them. So, uh, picked some of those up. And then a Carl Edwards uh, Ignite Hot Threads patch. Don't do a ton of racing, but it goes back to like having the uh, diversity and having just something for everybody. So, thought that was kind of cool. I mean, the mag alone is used as a buck. So, thought it was neat. And then, uh, this is cool. It's not numbered, though. It's like a Bernie Kosar, Jim Brown, um, dual patch from like 2003 Limited. Um, I'm not sure what the deal is with these. I've heard reports over the years that some of these like got out like back door. Um, I don't know if that's the case. Obviously, this is, I was, I was young when these came out. I would have been about 10 when this would have happened. But um, Kosar, Jim Brown, dual patch, still cool. Two of the better selling Cleveland Browns guys for us. Uh, more presidential stuff. Again, um, it sells, so picked up a few of them. I think I got three, yeah. Uh, three Obamas. Uh, cheap nines, I mean, again, price of grading, and then a PSA 10 12 update. So, again, both sides of the spectrum, but presidential stuff. People definitely, definitely collect it. I've ripped a bunch of the uh, Leaf Decision stuff. I've ripped cases over, of it over the years. Um, it's got all the big name politicians in it, it's got cut autos. Um, I enjoy it. It's, it's fun. It's something different. Um, but again, we sell a lot of it and, uh, people buy it. So this guy, I think he had what, three or four strength, 40 point games, uh, caps clinched home fields, uh, home field, home court. Uh, and I think it's the first time they've made the playoffs without LeBron in like 30 years. So star of the Cavs picked up four of those, uh, reds, Tony Perez, PSA 10 auto seemed like a good deal. And then Raleigh Fingers Auto at a 50. So there's that. All right, some more slabs as we wrap this up here. Shout out to those of you that have made it this far. Little David Robinson, the Admiral. Uh, Kobe, it's a seven. But uh, Kobe Cockburn, uh, PSA 10. Uh, Josh Jackson, uh, Lillard. Keegan Murray Auto broke the record for three-pointers by a rookie. Uh, Cyril gone Durant, another Star Wars. Uh, this is cool. This is probably more, my favorite card in this set. Is, this dude's an animal. Uh, Otani at a 199. McGregor numbered. Uh, some more Star Wars. And then you get in. This is the stuff I talked about in the video that I think was like, it was kind of showing the, hey, while they may say $15 and add up to a lot, not really worth that. Like last one of these is five bucks. Aquino doesn't sell. This is probably two to $4. Uh, last one of these John Morant's to 10 bucks. Uh, CJ McCollum, PSA 7, although it is a pop one. It's a PSA 7, like, fourth year McCollum. It's probably three bucks. Uh, Zach Collins, die cut, PSA 8. Again, probably two, three, four, five bucks. Uh, Bulbasaur, hollow, 10. Uh, some more Star Wars. I don't know as much about $45. I don't know enough about what this sells for a raw, but for a five, it seems a little aggressive, but we'll see. And then a really cool uh, Star Wars parallel. Not numbered, but love the Star Wars photography. Alright, don't want these to fall. Just like that. Uh, Brady McConnell. Pozo, 10. Hopefully I didn't butcher that name. Uh, Vlad Acuna. Uh, another one of those. I think we had one of those earlier. Glenn Otto, PSA 10. Roberto Alomar, 20 bucks. Green Refractor. I don't remember seeing that, but one of 99. That seems like it'll sell for more than 20 bucks. Uh, Mitch Garver. Albert Abreu. Uh, Brady McConnell again, Trevor Story, and Grayson Rodriguez. I think Grayson Rodriguez just got the call up. 
thought I saw that the other day. Uh, Seth Johnson, Wander, uh, Jake Gunther, Luke Little, uh, Bo Bichette, TJ Zook, uh, Jordan 8, Kyle Finnegan. A lot of baseball, so some of these I might have overlooked again. A non-numbered Aquino, non-licensed PSA 9. Uh, I can't imagine. Can't imagine that one will get to 20. So not knowing baseball as well, I could have overlooked something. Something could be sneaky good or something could be like, wow, that's overpriced. I'm not sure I would have known it just because, uh, again, baseball, especially the prospecting stuff, is not the stuff I uh, keep up too, too closely with. Uh, Rosario, some like cheap local stuff, Kluber, Green, uh, Lopez. Nice and Mattingly auto at a 25. Olave, Denzel Ward, Peacock, Carolel, Trayvon Walker. Uh, bought this. I feel like I'm supporting the University of Utah. Although Ohio State did not win the national championship, uh, Utah beat USC for Ohio State to get into the playoff uh, and produce an incredible game against Georgia. So shout out to Cam Rising for that. So there'll probably be a QB prospect going into next year. So I figured I'd grab it for a few bucks. Uh, Jake the Snake, Diana Taurasi, uh, Otani. Again, just he sells, man. He's so good. Uh, Sky Moore, FOTL, Harper at a seven. That's the shimmer. Uh, Casey Kane patch auto, uh, Chris Dacus auto at a 10. Uh, Tony Stewart, Kevin Harvick at a 35. Thought it was at a 25. Uh, Montana, oh, I totally did not catch that. And I normally catch the jersey numbered stuff. Uh, 16 of 25. I did not catch that. Um, I would typically point that out, but I didn't even look. I just saw it was a 10. Uh, Drexler, and then uh, Arvidas Sabonis. Out of 10, I think that's uh, Damana Sabonis for the Kings. That's his dad, isn't it? I think so. thought that's who that was. Uh, Rondell Moore, when I first pulled this out, I thought it was a rookie, and then I looked online. Uh, I found the non-auto that did 17, and that's when I realized it's not. Uh, Mahomes out of 10 Revol from Revolution, which is from uh, Zenith. Zenith. The Ultimate Mystery. Diana Taurasi uh, out of 10. Caleb Williams. I would assume at this point is the favorite to be the number one pick in 2024. So grab that. Uh, Lane Johnson, Jay Jettas, uh, Joe Namath, and that's part of that deal. And then this was a value box deal. I picked up a couple of those to end it, and we'll wrap it up. Uh, so this was like 15 bucks. Uh, but you got Duncan Robinson. That was $9. And then all of these got moved to the dollar box. Fryermuth, Waddle. Corey Kispert, Duncan out of 99, Antonio McDice Auto, uh, Taekwon Thornton, who's a Patriot, and Taj Gibson Auto. So, paid 15 bucks there. thought that was good. And then a value box, uh, some value box cards and an Eric Dickerson Auto for 50. Uh, Kevin Johnson Auto, uh, Daniel Gibson, Grant Williams, uh, Michael Thomas, and Akuda, both Buckeyes, FOTL parallels. Uh, they're both numbered to 25. Uh, talk about Iowa selling. Uh, Amir Smith, Marzette Auto, 21 of 25, kind of green Pulsar, and then an Eric Dickerson flashback auto from Prism out of 149. All-time great running back from Prism, great brand, 25 bucks, sure. We'll grab it. Cool auto, love the old-school Rams, uh, Rams jersey. So, so yeah, a lot of a uh, lot of stuff this time. Uh, picked up a lot of variety. The slab lot was really really cool. Um, just because, again, we move a ton of graded stuff. But a lot of other, like, mid-end solid pieces, uh, like Namath Auto, Ryan Howard 101, Steven Jackson booklet, um, some of the political stuff. Um, yeah, just a, a good variety on this. Did get one really nice PC card, obviously the biggest card of the weekend with the George Russell. Um, but, yeah, felt like the variety was good. A little Did a little bit of everything. Uh, yeah, it was, it was a fun trip to... To Vegas, so hopefully, hopefully we'll be able to be back on the road at another show here very soon. But for now, guys, that's all I got. Peace, guys.